been a while that you haven't seen me posting any ROM videos on this channel but when Android 12 came out I got amazed and decided to try on Poco F1. Hey guys what's up KSK here welcome back to the ROM videos now let's have the first look at Android 12 running on Poco F1 and see what's new and how a three-year-old smartphone still handles the latest update. This is the POCO F1 running Android 12 beta. Now starting with the lock screen, you can see there is a brand new revamped lock screen. Now you can find the clock on the top left and the all new notifications are positioned to the center. Now just like Android 12, swiping up from the bottom reveals the all new pixel launcher. Now this launcher has received some of the changes under the hood. The menu sheet looks different and the pixel launcher has a new widgets picker. The all new widget picker has organized all the widgets per app basis and it's very easy to pick any widget. Now each application shows the available widgets. For example, you can tap on the application to reveal the widgets available in different sizes. Now this way you can simply drag and drop the widgets to the home screen just like that. Like Android 11, a swiping up from the bottom reveals the app launcher where you get to see all of the installed applications. Now swiping to the right from the home screen shows the Google feed. You can notice each card has a rounded corner to the edges. Now swiping up from the bottom and holding a half second it takes you to the app switcher where you get to see all of the running applications in the system. Now just the same stuff you do always but have a look at each snapshot of an application that has a rounded corners to the edges. It's time to talk about the all new notifications and control center. Now swiping down from anywhere on the screen brings up the notifications panel where you can find all of the brand new notifications which are fantastic. Now these notifications are redesigned to look more modern and are more informative than iOS. Now swiping down for one more time takes you to the all new redesigned system controls. Now you can see there is a new brightness slider and each toggle looks completely different from Android 11. You can even customize and rearrange these toggles according to your liking. Now thanks to Material U, the all new UI adapts the colors from the wallpaper applied to the home screen and uses those colors from the system controls, buttons, labels across the system. One of the powerful features of Android 12 is going to give you a full control of the microphone and camera. Now, within the system control panel, you can block the microphone and camera modules system wide, which is fantabulous. Now, turning on these toggles prevent the remote user from taking your pictures and listening to your conversations secretly. Now, this way you will find yourself more secure. With Android 12, the settings page has been revamped. It looks more realistic than it used to be and gives an easy way to find any setting within a few hops. Now, there is a new battery page which has been revamped. The storage menu looks fresh and clean. The all new privacy dashboard gives a full control to an end user to block a certain system for core functionalities like location, microphone and more. Also, there is a brand new power menu, which you get to see in Android 12. And these are some of the new features of Android 12, and the Beast still handles much better than any mid-range smartphone out there. Now, Snapdragon 845 is still a king in 2021 when it comes to custom ROMs, and we can expect to see a more custom ROMs based on Android 12 will be ported to Poco F1. Now, I don't think so. Xiaomi will update the base system and vendor to Android 12 in the future, but we can expect to see a Pixel experience will be ported once the Android 12 stable update rolls out by Google. 
Also keep in mind, do not install this GSI on your POCO F1. It's not fully functional. You may find a lot of issues. Just don't install it on your main smartphone. Now wait for some more time and you will find a more custom ROMs based on Android 12 will be coming soon this year. Now if in case you still want to try to install Android 12, GSI and POCO F1, I'll leave a link to the description to a Munchies video. Just gonna go ahead and watch his video and show him support and follow his guide. Now, thanks for watching this video. It's been KSKRIL. I'll catch you in my next one. Peace.